Be go! Breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. Allow 2023 general elections to hold in Southeast State. One is the Berg's Allow 2023 general elections to hold in Southeast State. One is the Berg's Allow To my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read today's news. Sahara reporters had reported that the spokesperson of IPOL, Ima Powerful, had in a statement on Thursday stated that they would not compromise their agitation of Nigerian politics. The Apex Igbo Socio Cultural Organization, Owaneze Indibo, has begged the indigenous people of Biafra to allow the 2023 general elections to hold in the South Estate. Sahara reporters had reported that the spokesperson of IPOP, Ima Powerful, had in a statement on Thursday stated that they would not compromise their agitations for Nigerian politics. He also stressed that IPOP did not believe in Nigerian elections. Noting that the agitations were still intact and nothing would change the group's resolve towards the fight to achieve the Afro freedom through peaceful, non violent, globally accepted practices. Powerful was reacting to a statement credited to controversial Islamic cleric. Sheikh Gumi, who alleged the IPOB agitation had slowed down in the southeast since Peter Lobi picked the presidential ticket of the Labour Party. But the Oanese National Publicity Secretary, Alex Odonia, in an interview with Punch, appealed to IPOB to shut their swords and avoid allowing their anger to consume them. We appeal to our brothers in IPOB to allow the election to hold. The agitations are understandable, but they must not let anger consume them. Even during the turn of Chukuma Saludo, the first refused, but when we appealed to them, they listened. During the turn of Willie Obiano, we appealed to them and they listened. This time around, we want to plead that they also listen to us, he said. Sahara reporters had reported that the spokesperson of IPOP, Emma Powerful, had in a statement on Thursday stated that they would not compromise their agitations for Nigerian politics. The Apex Igbo Socio-Cultural Organization, 
Oaneze Indigo has begged the indigenous people of Biafra to allow the 2023 general elections to hold in Southeast states. Sahara reporters had reported that the spokesperson of IPOB, Emmanuel Powerful, had in a statement on Thursday stated that they would not compromise their agitations for Nigerian politics. He also stressed that IPOB did not believe in Nigerian elections, noting that their agitations were still intact and nothing would change the group's resolve towards the fight to achieve the Afro freedom through peaceful, non-violent, globally accepted practices. Powerful was reacting to a statement credited to controversial Islamic cleric Sheikh Gumi, who alleged that IPOB agitation had slowed down in the southeast since Peter Lobi picked the presidential ticket of the Labour Party. But the ONZ National Publicity Secretary, Alex Obonia, in an interview with Punch, appealed to IPOP to share their swords and avoid allowing their anger to consume them. We appeal to our brothers in IPOP to allow the election to hold. Their agitations are understandable but they must not let their anger consume them. Even during the turn of Chukuma Soludo, the first refused but when we appealed to them, they listened. During the turn of Willie Obiano, we appealed to them and they listened. This time around, we want to plead that they also listen to us. To my dear listeners from wherever you're listening from, now we've come to the end of our today's news. Please do drop by at the comment section and let us know what your view is all about. Thank you for listening.